so sorry about the song in the back. Just like that song in the back. <laughs> Please follow me on Instagram at Kids and Ivy. Um, down in the description box below. <laughs> I'll put the link to it, guys. It's a hair vlog from Lamy the Weirdo, and it is ten o'clock on the twenty fifth of September. And I haven't done anything to my hair since the conditioner that you guys saw me put on the other day. And so, nourishment for braids, locks, twists, coils, and chronically dry scalp and hair. So I have to introduce you guys to kind of the wash routine that I do with my hair. But that's kind of like like something I have to prep doing with my hair like KK for a week like you know it has to be um like shampoo and conditioner every day and like just you know really wash my hair and then yeah um enriched with coconut oil shea butter and extra virgin olive oil um auntie Jackie's girls this is bottle i know that sometimes you should um i know it's recommended that you should put um you should boom up your oil before you use it you need to put it on your skin but honestly i'm so cute with a pink top thing um It smells so good. I'm just gonna put it on my scalp. Because I don't know until Monday or Tuesday if I can like brush my. <coughs> <coughs> brush my hair because it's like. I have 4B hair because my hair does have a bit of a curl and um like but I don't I don't like I'm not like I watch hair routines by 4C girls 4C hair girls so I'm just like, <clears throat> I don't really detangle like that. I detangle after I braid my hair, you know? So, I mean, <laughs> um, but I'm not going to go that crazy. I just want to kind of treat it like a hair treatment. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I literally... What are some of the hair routines that you guys have? Um, if you would like to share them with me, I really would not mind trying your guys' hair routines to be honest because it's like that's like content for you guys if you want me to try out some hair like you know whatever you would like to see me try like hair treatments that you guys do on your hair regardless if you're Caucasian I don't mind girl is it Tresemme I'll do it for the video. I use Tresemme for my shampoo and conditioner.
um, a little bit of ASMR for you guys. Just look at the other half of my hair. After I put oil on it. Can you see the difference? Like, the side is more, and the side is kind of still dry. And this way. Can you, can you see the difference? I just put oil in it. Auntie Jackie's hair products on my hair. Because my sister has 4C hair. And it, and like, it doesn't make her scalp a bit dry. But these products help detangle my hair. Like, for detangling, I could use it. But not like as a... As a base, because my hair gets dry. So, I mean, I have to braid it, but I don't even, I don't even know if I will be able to braid it anytime soon, literally. So I'm kind of just have to get used to washing it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, because I will be showing you guys hair vlogs. Where I wash my hair. I'm literally, I should like, I should record a hair video of me rubbing my scalp with my ASMR channel that I will link down below. Comment down below if you have hairline issues. If you have hairline remedies for me too, because I've been using castor oil on my hair, and granted, I've probably like, I, I don't know. I probably should use castor oil. I should probably go buy castor oil, or like, just um maybe let me know <laughs> what your hair advice is for my hairline because my hairline over here is a bit shorter than the back so Some of my cardinal members at the back. Cool. Detangling is going to be a mission effort because I have not combed my hair. So I'm just going to wash it and try and detangle it with um, something, <laughs> with the conditioner. Let me put the treatment, like the hair food on my scalp. So maybe I'll even show you which hair food I use. After I wash my hair and I'll apply it on my scalp for you guys so you guys can see the difference of my hair when um, I put hair food on it because you'll see the curls start to form a little bit as well. Like right now my hair looks like 4C hair. I will admit it. That's I was a bit confused. I was like calling my hair for C here. 
it is not for CV. Look at how oily my hands are. Look at how long my hair is. My hair just blew out my hair. I tried to record that for you guys, but I was just not in the mood to. Um. Look at my hair. Ah. Literally, this was me last year. This is growth since last year, May, June, roughly June. I dyed my hair in June. Quarantine, right, right, right. <laughs> so yeah, like look at how long my hair is here, and my hair is like cutting a bit of layers because I had a perm let me talk about my story of having a perm make sure to like comment and subscribe to Lani the weirdo and follow my instagram at orphic and edit um you guys literally this is my hair after putting oil in it let me bring it let me just come closer yeah Yeah. <coughs> Let me talk about my perm hair journey while I finish applying that. So make sure to watch that video too. Thank you guys for watching my video.